What's up everybody, how are you doing? It's been a while since I did a vlog style format video, so that's what I'm out here doing. What's up to all the new subscribers that have subscribed to my channel? I just wanna say thank you. I am in this like sculpture guy type thing. I just took a sick photo, I'm gonna upload that up to Instagram, but I had help. Well, I just met her. You wanna come <laughs> on? What, what was your name? LP. LP. I just wanna ask you a couple questions if you're comfortable. I'm comfortable. Um, what is your hobby and what inspires you? Those are the two questions. My hobby is fitness. My passion is doing everything opposite of what I was not taught as a kid. So confidence, I want to empower young girls and women, even men, confidence, love themselves, making fitness fun, showing people the ways that fitness can help you mentally, physically, emotionally. So yes, if you want to know what I'm always up to, I'm always working out. Yoga, swimming, lifting, going back right now into um, photography, I used to take it in school, so I'm thinking about taking all pictures I've taken in all my life and making a photo book. And that is coming out of my comfort zone for sure. I just need like to figure out how to do it. <laughs> I'm using manual focus, so I'm doing everything manual, trying to, you know, really learn my equipment and get better with what I have. So I'm out here. You know, and I'm visiting from New York, so. Oh, awesome, <laughs> sick. So welcome to Atlanta. Thank you. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> Meeting friends all over the place. So yes. you can take this message with you forever. Ever. And it's you know, never you'll... too late. That's my that's my slogan. I think my site is called Never Too Late Fitness. It's never too late to start anything. If you want to come out of your comfort zone, it's never too late to try to come out of your comfort zone. It's never too late to push someone else to come out of their comfort zone. So yeah, it's awesome. cool. Well, See, I'm out here doing my thing and meeting friends. I, I really appreciate your time and nice to meet you. And, nice uh, to meet you. Yeah, well, yeah. Now I'm headed to this Krog Street tunnel. It's supposed to be really cool for photos and stuff like that. It's, it's a tunnel that's just graffiti and apparently it just, it changes every day. Everybody just comes in and just spray paints whatever they want. And it's okay, I guess. I don't know. It's about a 1.1 mile walk and I'm on the belt line. I'm gonna continue onwards. Also, I'm gonna challenge myself. I just met one person. She was actually watching me shoot a photo. So I met her, she's from New York. That was really cool. The challenge was, was to meet three people today, ask them a couple questions about if they have any hobbies, anything that inspires them. It's a challenge. Get out of my comfort zone, probably help somebody get out of theirs and maybe help them realize what they want to do. made it up here <laughs> I just met these two guys and I saw them trying to run up this this embankment right here so I was like hey why not get it on camera so I literally climbed to here and now I'm up here what's up dude hey how's it going I'm man? Drew Mizan how's it going man so how are you doing today man I'm having a great day had some nice brunch Heck yeah. You know, hanging out with a friend for her birthday, and now I'm just walking the belt line, man. It's my favorite part of town. Sick, sick. I'm actually out here because I wanted to challenge myself to meet three people. And okay. just get out of my comfort zone and just put it on video. Hell yeah. It's been a minute since I've been, done anything like this, so let me ask you a couple questions real sure, quick. Sure. So do you have any hobbies, and what inspires you? So photography is a big passion of mine, too, and as well as that, my favorite thing is to meet new people. It's it's literally one of my favorite things to do is um, I'm very adventurous 
adventurous and then just being spontaneous, right? Trying different things. My tagline is, when was the last time you did something for the first time? Dude, that's, that's my that, thing. Dude, that's, that's perfect, dude. So, yeah. you know, you always got to start somewhere and yep. today is a good day to start. So Absolutely. if you're trying to start anything right now, just pick it up, <laughs> whatever it is, photography, painting, sculpting, kayaking, whatever. Get out there, start it today, and I promise you will be better off. I mean, you just will. I mean, you'll find new passions, you know, like you'll, you might find the meaning of life from what you're looking for because you won't, you'll never find what you're looking for as long as you stay in your comfort zone. But that being said, I'm going to slide on down. Yep. You know, I may need your help getting down, to be honest. All right. All right, Hold that vine. That's what I did to get up here. So put your foot down on that rock first. Okay. And then leverage this right here. And then slide down. Come on. For the shot. So put your foot on there. Yeah, there you go. And then grab onto that one right there. Ah, uh, what up guys? Let's do this. Alright. Yeah, I got you. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, that was sick. Nice. Hey man, it was yeah. nice seeing you dude. Have a good day, man. So I've uh, set my GPS. I got 0.9 miles to go till I hit Crog Street Market. Or not Crog Street Market. I guess there's Market and then there's a Crog Street Bridge, I believe. It's uh, a little longer and we'll be there. I just hit up this place um, underneath the bridge. That wasn't Crog Street. That's just some other bridge that you can spray paint. Still got a, a little while to go. 18 minutes. So see you in a minute. I've got five minutes. Can you see that? But what's that smell? Anyways, five minutes, five minutes to go and I'll be there. Crog Street Bridge. I'm gonna go get some dope footage of some paintings. It's really loud in here. I've already been through it, got a sick time lapse. So I'm gonna walk my way back through. Uh, so yeah, man, this place is sick. Let me find some light, dude. It's so dark in here. Perfect. A little bit of light. I've met a couple people and you've met two of them already. So I'm gonna continue on. I gotta find that last person. Maybe go meet up and uh, go grab a beer because whew, I'm thirsty and it has been, it's been a crazy day. So that's what I'm gonna go do. Wow, now you can see me. I wasn't on the right setting. See, that's what, I, that's what I'm talking about. You gotta get out here, learn. Learning the settings on your gear will make my life easier. It's been a successful day. The reason I'm out here is because of a quote that I read. It was a meme or something that I saw on Instagram. And it said that if you try to avoid all the failures then you miss out on opportunities so that's what i'm doing i'm trying to get out of my comfort zone and find these opportunities meeting new people and it's just it's, it's awesome because you never know where these people are coming from or just like earlier i met that one girl she was from new york that's cool it's awesome i mean you, you never know who you're gonna meet so i got a time lapse in there i'm out of breath this vlogging stuff is very tiring. It's very tiring. So now I'm gonna go meet the last person I need to meet for this challenge that I'm doing, meeting three people in a day and just asking them what their hobby is and what inspires them. Cause I'm out here doing stuff that inspires me and this is my hobby. So what better way to involve other people that are doing the same thing? Onward we go. So as I'm editing, I did realize that I didn't capture the third person that I met. I'm gonna rewind a little bit. This guy in the red hat right here, he was actually in the middle of a photo shoot when I was doing the little time-lapse guy that you just saw. If you wanna follow him, his Instagram handle's right here. It's Forward Movement Photography. Go check out his work. He's got some awesome stuff out there. All right, back to the vlog.
that is it for today's video. I had fun doing it. I wanted to get out of my comfort zone, but I ended here, Pond, Pond City Market. I got yelled at by the security guard. You can't film here. Yeah, it was a cool day. It was fun. If you like this video, you know, please hit that like button and, and throw some feedback in, that, in those comments because that's gonna help me. Nobody says anything. So I don't know if that's good or bad. Hello. Who knows? Let me know. Put them in those comments. If you want me to do anything cool, if you have suggestions for the channel where I need to go or whatever, I know I don't have any value yet, but you know, I'm learning the aspects of video creation, content creating, and this is it. I really appreciate it, everybody, and anybody that watches this channel. You are the true MVPs, and I will see you in the next video. Woo!